Hi, it's Kat again from Assert Self-Defense and Empowerment. And in this section, we're going to talk about why self-defense is important. Again, are you worth fighting for? There's not one instructor in this entire group. In fact, there's not one instructor I know in any martial art or any school. There really isn't anybody I know personally that wouldn't stand up and fight for somebody who needed it. But it doesn't do any good if you're not willing to stand up and fight for yourself also. Self-defense is not only important for self-preservation, to protect ourselves, but it's also important for life in general. Self-defense is how we garner our own spiritual worth, our own value. Without having a sense of worth, without having a sense of value, then in every aspect of life, people can walk all over us. It's not just about a physical thing. The problem is that the majority of crimes that are done to us in aggravated assaults and things like that, many of them are more boundary issues. the more cunning manipulation of our space and our worth than they are an aggravated assault situation from a stranger. Our overall goal is to be able to move from a sense of confidence, not a fear-based thinking. Might, the actions might end up being the same, but we can feel when somebody's trying to tell us something out of a sense of fear or anxiety or with ulterior motives than a true sense of self and importance and worth. If you ever doubt it, look at a family that has little kids and you'll be able to tell. Those kids know from little tone, little body postures, all these subtle little things when a parent is serious and saying no. Or when they're like, no, and they can be pushed in order to have it happen anyway to the kids liking. So self-defense isn't just plainly a, a shield. It's not Superman underoos. It's not something we put on and then, oh, and we're, in, we're undefeatable. It's something that because we move from inside, it's about human rights. It's about standing up against abuses all over the place and in all aspects of life. Is about having a solidity of our own nature. It's important to remember that self-defense is not a martial art. That doesn't mean that we don't have kicking, that punching, that we're not doing striking. But the goal of a martial art and the goal of self-defense, although they might share some concepts, they're at odds. In martial arts, we stick in it. We do things with people. In self-defense, we do things to people. And our goal is escape always escape. That being said, self-defense is really important to understand. I have a lot of people that are pacifists as their students. I'm not exactly, I do not believe in violence and doing violence to, do, doing violence to people. But it's important to understand that self-defense is not about doing violence, it's about combating violence. It's also important to understand that as we train, we're utilizing the physical aspects of this, the self-defense, the movement, everything, to empower us, to bring up from in us the mental, emotional, and spiritual aspects of life, to train those also. We're just using that as a key to get to the other portals. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good day.